you craving for some egg roll like the African egg roll then stay tuned relax over a cup of water juice wine and let's get frying see this is one recipe you do not want to miss family welcome today we are making egg rolls so we start by boiling our eggs First, you want to dip your eggs in a pot of cold water before placing it on the stove. So here we have our eggs. We are going to boil it for 15 to 20 minutes. I went ahead and added a tablespoon of salt in the eggs. Like I said, boiling it without covering the pot is going to maintain the egg yolk color. Like to a shiny yellow color, it will not turn dark. So we are going to boil it like this. And... Yeah. So in a clean bowl, I'm going to sieve and add 12 cups of all-purpose flour. Make sure it actually levels the cup. So we add half a cup of sugar, three teaspoons of nutmeg, two teaspoons of salt, three teaspoons of baking powder. You have to sieve everything so that you can remove all of these residues. See that? After adding everything, you want to mix very well to combine. Make sure you really mix like you actually mix everything together. You don't want one side of your dough tasting salt or some tasting sugar. The ingredients just scattered all about. So that's the reason you really have to mix this very well. See, I have a cold. That's why you can hear my voice is like that. But ignore the voice and let's do some frying. Now you're going to create a little hole in the middle and then an add your body. So, one pound. There. Mix very well. So, you want to mix your butter until you have this crumbling feel. You can see how it looks like. Look at that. So this is just perfect. <coughs> now you're going to create another hole and then you add your eggs. I beat my egg already, so I'm just gonna go ahead and add it. So after adding our eggs, we are going to be adding our milk. So we are going to be using evaporated milk. I'm not going to add everything at once. I'm going to add gradually and mix. We are going to cover this with a plastic wrap and let it rest in the refrigerator for 15 to 20 minutes while we peel up the eggs. So now that the eggs are cold and everything, you want to peel up, start peeling up your eggs. And they're peeling off so beautifully, like... Look at how smoothly this is peeling off. So you want to repeat the process for the remaining eggs. I'll be heating it up to 310 degrees because I don't want it too hot. I want to cook the egg roll gradually so it gets cooked right all the way inside. 
so we are going while this is heating up we are going to be rolling the dough and wrapping the eggs in okay now so we are going to start rolling the dough so we roll wrap it and then fry because we don't want it to stand for too long so i'm going to be making them in groups of 10. so what i do first is i round them like in smaller balls like this smaller balls not too big and then i'll just pick them and roll them so before i went ahead to start rolling i went in with a paper towel to dry out my eggs like one after the other so the reason i'm rolling it out really good making sure the edges are thin and tiny because i want to seal make sure i actually seal in the eggs take your egg you see how dry my egg is and then just put place it right at the edge roll pinch the sides and roll look at what i'm doing i'm pushing in the sides like that like see and keep rolling and pinching inward inwardly because you actually want to seal in the egg sometimes i pull like backward as i'm i'm rolling forward to make sure the the edge is really thin so getting to the edge i pull i kind of pull it a little bit backward and then now you slightly roll it like just a few times not pressing too hard look at that you see how well sealed again like starting from out outwardly coming inwardly see how i'm rolling not forgetting to pinch both edges you pinch them inwardly like you want to fold them like towards you see that you want to really pinch those because you don't want them to open up keep rolling and pinching and rolling and slightly making as if you want to pull it backwardly like that and pinching and rolling until you get to the end and then now you can slightly lightly roll it not pressing too hard like lightly roll like that to completely seal the 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 joint so it doesn't open up in the process of frying look at that you barely can even tell where the the line ends see right here it's well sealed and you know this deep fryer is really big so we are frying 14 this lower it in see that that is how you want to lower and let the oil be so it's gonna cook gradually it's gonna cook gradually and cook every piece of it we fry this between 15 to 20 minutes just low to medium not so high I'm frying on 275 degrees batch is ready and so we are going to take it out and continue frying okay look at this goodness right now look at how yummy delicious this is looking okay family look at this delicious yep. egg roll yes baby do you like it yep yep okay mj loves the egg roll see look at how appetizing uniformly this is looking this is so delicious okay let's try one and see you are the unfortunate one the fortunate one okay so Oof. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Look at this goodness. <laughs> See. Delicious. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. Please let me know in the comment section if you actually tried this recipe. What you think. Give me your feedback. We would love to know about it. And if you do have any recipe that you want us to try, please let us know in the comment section. Thank you and have a blessed and beautiful day. Enjoy. We will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.